Hello YouTube, I'm Music Kev, and this is Legend of Zelda Link Between Worlds. Um, I was watching my fifth episode and was reminded of that message in the bottle. And whenever I came up here, I saw a Shadow Link that I think I might actually be able to beat. So, what I'm going to do is show you a fight between a Shadow Link. I'm going to equip some healing items because that will actually allow me to use them without losing them. This is a battle against Shadow Link. If I win, I get 390 rupees. I think I should be able to take them. And as long as I don't fall off the cliff. Okay, this is getting annoying. Yeah. Okay, so I was trying to tap my uh, potion to, to drink it. But apparently tapping the screen doesn't work. Yeah, that doesn't count as a death. Don't put it on the death counter. Don't do it. Yeah, those guys are actually supposed to be hard to defeat. And let's have this, see what's in the bottle. There's a letter inside. I was up on the mountain doing some bouldering when I lost my grip and fell and sort of hurt, hurt, hurt myself. Eh, all the day of a boulder. Going climbing without equipment that isn't for the faint of heart. Anyway, I'm stuck on the mountain, way past the Tower of Hera, and I could really go for some premium milk. Yeah, that really get me up and going again. So if you're at the milk bar, pick some up for me. So, I guess I have to use my well-earned rubies. Really stupid. I have to use my well-earned rubies to, um, sorry about the echo, I just realized that my computer was also making a sound. I have to use my well-earned rubies to get this guy out of a jam. So, here's what I'm going to do. I am going to go to the milk bar. I'm going to speed over to the milk bar. And get that premium milk. Um, if... I need to drink it for myself between now and the time I actually meet this boulderer guy. I will do that because I'm a jerk. In the meantime, I have to go to um, Skull Woods. That's where I learned is another piece of the Master Ore. Um, and by learned, I mean totally remembered all by myself. So here's my premium milk. Looks delicious. So he's at the Tower of Hera, and now two people are counting on me to, to save this guy. You know what? Before I make my way into Skull Woods, which is basically the Lost Woods version of um, what is it? Of Low Rule, I'm going to quickly go and meet this guy up here. Yeah, it's a little bit out of my way, but. Whenever you have the ability to teleport, it's really not that big a deal. I really hope he's not too far in because those guys are dangerous. Leave me alone. There's a piece of heart over there, but I'm not going to mess with it right this second. Jeez, oh I cannot take hits right now. I have no idea where to find this guy. I really hope I don't have to go in anything. Like I said, if I need to drink... Oh, wait, there he is. I wonder how I get down to him. Okay, I think I know how to get down to him. Just need to get past this idiot first. You're fire, I'm ice. Jeez Louise. Oh, that didn't do anything except just make him angry. Okay, frozen for a second, now I can get past. Alright, I think I go through here and then go down and then I get to him. I really hope that's the case. Oh lord, that doesn't look good. Okay, here goes nothing. Yeah, this is another place where that three-dimensional thinking comes into play. I basically just fall. Luckily, it's not to my death. Though it might be to my death if any of these guys catch me in their fire breath. Ooh, hello. Goodbye. Oh, no. Come back. I need to ride you. 
I really hope it returns before I run out of energy. It's not going to. There it is. Okay. That was a close one. I didn't like that one bit. I'm really hoping that this is the way I need to go. And not just a way to lead me to losing more hearts. I need to watch out for this little spiky trap thingy-majig. Ooh, there's two of them. I think I'm going to go this way. Honestly, it's never good when you don't know exactly where you're supposed to be going. Especially in Legend of Zelda games, because it tends to be a hassle to go back the way you came. But this seems to be at the right level. Well, I got a Maya Maya out of it. But not much else. I need to be higher. So I think I need to go up a level and to the left. Well, actually, I know I do because that's the way that the uh, the other door is. Um, I really hope this guy gives me something good for bringing him premium milk. Especially when, you know, I could just drink it myself. What does it do exactly? It's just no ordinary milk. That's um, very descriptive. I think this is all just a ploy to get some premium milk for free. But I guess he gave it to me for free, so it didn't cost me anything. Hi, buddy. Ugh, how embarrassing. I was bouldering along just fine when I slipped and fell. I twisted my ankle, and now I'm stuck. Wait, is that what I think it is? Milk? Ice-cold milk? And not just any milk, but some premium milk? Gimme! Ah... That really hit the spot. Best milk in the kingdom, right? Uh, wait. Oops. Did I drink the whole thing? Sorry, friend. After you came all this way. How about doing me another favor? Here, take this garbage away. Yeah, the bottle's definitely garbage for anybody else except for me. Because I will totally use that. Alright. Back to the quest. I need to find my way into Skull Woods. And that entrance should be somewhere in the Lost Woods. Um. It's... If this game is anything like Link to the Past, and I know it is, the interesting thing about Skull Woods is that I can't get there that way. The interesting thing about Skull Woods is that it tends to ha make the um, dungeon itself and the forest kind of combine into one. So whenever I go in here, I'm going to have to be very aware of which gates I take into low roll. Like, for example, this one. They're going to be on these weird posts. Hi, Hilda. Welcome back to low roll kingdom, Music Kev. You are in the area where the Skull Woods strike fear into the hearts of the living. Not that there are many who live here for long. Within the woods are beings no longer of this world. But brave them you must if you are to recover a sage who is pure of heart. Gather your courage. So say I, Hilda of Lowrule. A sage who is pure of heart. Oh, and you know what? Now that, you, now that I think of it, Gully was the one who was playing in the woods. So I wonder if this is where Gully is. That is not the Skull Woods. I need to continue exploring in here. Um, Skull Woods does, is known for having a lot of dead ends. A lot of ghosts. And a lot of portals between the worlds. Oh, hi, Mai Mai. In the grass, really? It's a good thing I didn't try to find... I'm not actively trying to find these things, or I could spend a lot of time just doing that. Oh, look. It's Ceres, so it's not Gully. Well, at least I know where I'm trying to get to. Let's see what's in here. Hi, it's another dead guy. So they finally sent a rescue party. Uh, you know, party, you're just a kid. Let me guess, you came in here looking for some extreme fun in the great outdoors, huh? Yeah, I've been running crazy in these woods. Running until I got dizzy. Trunking, I call it. Trunked round and round these bees, trees until I finally lost my way. I've been sitting here ever since. But I found a great treasure in the woods. Maybe you'd care to take it off my hands? A little something I picked up when I got stuck. I just decided to keep it. How's 888 rubies sound? It's a steal of a deal. I don't have that many rubies, and I feel like you're playing me. Only a fool would buy an unknown item from its stranger. You're going to turn out just fine, man. Just fine. Well, I guess he just told us himself that the item that he has is completely useless. And again, in the off chance that it is a 
useful thing, I might need to take him up on that offer. Go away, you stupid crow. Tyrannosaurus Rex thing. Okay, there's got to be a way into that dungeon from here. Unless, like I said, I've been taken advantage of by the fact that not all the gates lead to something that is accessible. So if that's where I need to go, then go there I shall. I just need to get there in high roll so I can get there in low roll. I like this music better anyway. That's where you get the Master Sword. This is the exact same song from the, um, from the game before. I bet you I can get across there. Yes, I can. I wonder what's through here. It's a dude. Hey, I know you. You're that little music cat, right? I saw that shooty chain thing you used to get here. It looks fun. Heh, <laughs> looks like you've gotten used to swinging a sword around, music cat. What makes you say that? Is, is he just... Huh? Going home? That's a shame. Lots of stuff I could tell you. Interesting stuff, huh? Want some gossip? Tell me. You like to know other people's secrets. Whom do you want to know? Um, Gramps. You want to hear about old Gramps, eh? Well, this isn't a rumor. This is one I saw with my own two peepers, but I probably shouldn't say anything. You know me. I'm not one to gossip. I might get in trouble if I told you. But on the other hand, if you really want to know, I mean... Okay, well... So Gramps in Kakariko Village, near the town square, he's 80 years older, so he says. I don't think he's just some ordinary man who's just hanging around. So at one time, I saw him at the crack of dawn. You never guessed what he was doing. Cuckoo calling? Well, he's always doing that. I don't know how you knew that, but that's not the weird part. He was doing handstands. Not ordinary handstands, one-fingered handstands. Really, I saw it. Either he's doing some sort of intense training, or he's got some secret abilities he's hiding. I don't want to be on that guy's bad side, so I didn't tell you nothing. Now you've heard it. Go on now. That gossip ain't gonna spread itself. I wonder if I go in back into Kakariku, if I can take advantage of that gossip somehow. I'm not exactly sure how I would, per se, but... Stupid crows. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure how to get into that part of Skull Woods. So, I'm gonna go ahead and leave it for next time. On Legend of Zelda. Link Between Worlds. I'm Musikev, and next time, I'll be ready to go at Skull Woods.